Well, Gina Mike, state troopers say it appears that driver impairment may have played a role in this crash. Now, 911 calls started coming in right around 1140 last night. State police say 31 year old Ryan Kittredge of Derry was driving a Dodge pickup on Route 101 West, made a U turn on the same side of the highway, and began driving east. Moments later, Kittredge's truck collided head on with a Chevy Impala, killing retired Townsend, Massachusetts Police Sergeant John Johnson and his wife. Heidi. The couple was from New Ipswich. Kittredge was flown to Massachusetts General Hospital with serious injuries. He is expected to recover. Police say drugs or alcohol appear to have been a factor in the crash. However, they did not say what led them to that conclusion. Our message to the public is uh, that we will be out there enforcing DWI drunk and drugged um, laws to the best of our ability. Um, in this particular case, I'm not sure uh, there was anything Mr. and Mrs. Johnson could have done to prevent this crash. Now, a third vehicle was actually also involved in this crash. However, the driver of that car received minor injuries. Now, as you can imagine, the Townsend Police Department is in mourning this evening. WMUR Siobhan Lopez is joining us live there now with how they're remembering Sergeant Johnson and his wife. Well, the police chief here in Townsend broke the news to the community with a post on the department's Facebook page. Since then, they have just been flooded with condolences of, from other people who are also mourning this tragic loss. He'll be missed. He'll be missed by us. He'll be missed by his family and the community. 58 year old John Johnson, a retired sergeant with the Townsend Police Department, is being remembered for a lifetime of service to the community he grew up in. It was great that he got a chance to retire. We missed him. Uh, all that he did. Uh, it's just tragic that, you know, he retired at the end of July and this happens today. Black bunting hangs over the department and the flag flies at half staff, a solemn tribute to the 39 year veteran. He rose to the rank of sergeant, uh, did a lot of different things for the police department. And also for the community, Police Chief Rick Bailey fondly remembers Sergeant Johnson taking an active role in the Senior Center cookout. John would bring all his cooking equipment there and uh, he was the main chef. You could see that in the, uh, in the picture. In the short time he had in his retirement, Johnson wasn't quite ready to fully say goodbye. I think he was, re he was planning to just enjoy himself and uh, be with his family and uh, he was Continued, he was going to work for us part time. He was hired as a, a reserve officer to work so he could work when he wanted to work and help us out. Johnson and his wife Heidi most recently lived in New Ipswich, New Hampshire. The couple killed together in the crash leave behind extended family and friends across the region. I don't have words for the family and how they must feel. Now the chief here says once they learn more information about funeral arrangements, they will share all of that with the public. We're live in Townsend, Massachusetts tonight. Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.